hi guys this video talks about uh, network analysis tool in the ArcGIS uh, if you see that network analysis tool we can see that tool is one of the uh, net uh, tool package of tool in the ArcGIS uh, today I will explain how to prepare data for that uh, this different different analysis I have created that residential layer and also supermarket layer uh, and also road network normally that residentials we get as a polygon uh, it's like a building therefore we get it as a polygon like that you can see it's like a uh, polygons but in this analysis we cannot use polygons therefore we want to convert it into uh, points I have used that feature to point tool to convert that polygons into point that's how create that building layer into uh, a point layer then supermarkets normally we are we are taking that uh, locations as a uh, points and also road network that's very special very important uh, our analysis we can do based on the distance if you want to find new roads uh, based on the distance based on the uh, travel time if you want to do that analysis based on distance and time we need to include that time distance everything in the uh, segments uh, before that we need to prepare that road network into segments normally if we see that segment yeah in that case we can see normally in this analysis takes this kind of segments uh, between two junctions we can see only one segment in that case we can see two segments between these two junctions therefore we need to uh, make that two segments into one segment then we can do our analysis for that first what we want to do is uh, we want to dissolve that whole road layer okay okay uh, now if you see it's one layer whole layer become uh, one layer then what we want to do is we can uh, separate these segments based on these junctions to do that we want to use feature to line tool Put that dissolve tool okay now let's see it has separated from that uh, junctions if we go to previous example you can see it has separated as a one segment okay now road network is okay uh, now we want to include distance and time uh, field we need to add new field it's length don't forget to uh, type that name if you want if you want to include the distance data you need to uh, give a name as a length and also don't do any spelling mistakes then it will not take uh, then go to double uh, then we can calculate that segment distance 
I will give readers okay then time then another uh, field for time uh, but we cannot type name as a time we want we want to give uh, name as a minutes you also don't do any spelling mistakes okay if you want to calculate that time uh, time mean if we take that segment if we take that segment how many minutes will take to uh, go past that segment that's what call time in that segment uh, I will calculate time for each and every segment for that we need kind of uh, speed uh, normally that car speed is average car speed is it's uh, 40 kilometers per hour therefore I will add another lay, another field call uh, speed how that speed normally uh, normally we have if we take that different different segments those different segments has so different different segments have different speeds with the condition of the road with of the road different different scenarios the uh, effect to that but in that analysis I will take uh, same number for uh, all segments uh, to explain that uh, I will give uh, normal car speed average car speed it's actually uh, <coughs> uh, 40 kilometers that mean 4000 uh, 40,000 meters okay then I can calculate what is the time that formula is distance separate distance divided by uh, speed uh, this is actually uh, our hourly speed so but in that case i want uh, speed time for minutes therefore divide by 760 okay All are very small segments uh, okay uh, now it's okay now what we want to do is we can we can prepare a road network we can ready that road network to uh, analysis for that what we want to do is right click on that uh, that road layer then net a new network data set don't forget to include that uh, <coughs> that time and also length details before before doing that uh, network analysis data before before we apply that new network data set uh, tool uh, here what they are uh, talking is uh, turns we don't have uh, include that turns details into my attributes therefore I will give uh, I will give no then elevation details I have not entered any elevation details <coughs> Uh, and also that length I have calculated that length under meters therefore I want to put it as a meters and also minutes uh, I have included as a minutes therefore I want to select minute then ok again it talks about that uh, driving directions any direction details 
I have not included that any direction details therefore no then finish yes yes okay that's how create data set for uh, our analysis in my next videos I will explain one by one tool that new uh, beginning of the uh, video you can see that all of the uh, tools have locked but in after create that layers all of the data set uh, after create that data set it has uh, on now we can use those uh, tools uh, in my next videos I will explain that one by one all of that tools analysis how to do these analysis and how to use how to interpret those analysis i will explain it in my uh, next videos thank you and also i have uh, uh, a small advertisement if you want if you need any gis uh, remote sensing uh, support you can contact me via uh, fiverr uh, i have an account uh, i'm always uh, happy to support you you can contact me i will put my that link in the description you can click on that uh, link and come into my profile and you can put an order uh, you can put an order uh, under my profile then i will support you uh, thank you